Okay, here's a tutorial. WASD is to move. Uh, there is shift lock. It is shift to shift lock to take out your weapon. It is F to, to put it back. It's F again to double to sprint. You have to double tap W to roll. You can press Q. You can also roll midair like this. There you go. Uh, in the spawn area, there's some shopkeepers or NPCs. This guy is the shop. You can buy weapons, armors, and items from this kid. This guy is a premium shop. You can buy for Robux. This is the tutorial person. He'll give you a little, uh, just not the best tutorial, but it's better than nothing. This guy resets stats for 50k one or 20 Robux. Uh, this guy will give you a hunter job if you switch to miner, which I'll go over later. Uh, this guy is the class manager, which you can change your class for 100 Robux. Okay, anyways, um, this place also has upstairs. If you didn't know, go to this elevator, click the green button, and then if you reach the minimum requirements, talk to this guy. You can get a national hunter rank. There you go. All right, we're gonna go back down, and I'm gonna talk about the stats. You see these stats here. I'll put on screen what you can do with the stats, and as for reputation. Uh, you, I'll also put on screen what you can do with reputation or what you obtain from achieving reputation. You can get reputation from uh, defeating dungeons and you get stats from leveling up obviously. Oh, to access your inventory you can access this backpack or press B which you then can uh, access your inventory where your, your weapons, armors, and items can be found which you can obtain from dungeons, from clearing dungeons and for your like uh, player area, whatever this is called uh, you can equip items by, by clicking on the slot and putting it on here you know what, actually first let me show you how to de-equip items so to de-equip items you want to right click there you go, it's de-equipped and to put it back on you want to uh, left click this and then left click the slot you want to put in uh, by the way, if you have your weapon out, you cannot retrieve it back. So make sure to retrieve your weapon back, and then you can de-equip it. Same goes for same goes for armor. For this slot, it's like this clothing over here. Speaking of clothing, you can buy clothing from this shop over here. It's cost some one to buy it. Also over here is the hunters ground. It's the PVP arena. Uh, basically, you have to be level 250 minimum to join the arena. If you kill players, you get rep. If you die, you lose rep. Okay, you'll know when gates. Oh, for gates, gates spawn in uh, periodically around the map and disappear. By this message, you'll know that gates just spawn. You can see by these little bold icons. Uh, basically, there's different types of gates. For the example, C rank and red gate. I'll have on screen the levels requirement needed to join them. And for the events, if you want to do the event stuff, uh, basically you talk to this guy who's kind of near spawn. He's inside this cave. It's the Shinobi event right now, where you can uh, uh, trade in 50 scrolls to get have a chance to get one of these items. Oh yeah, and to get scrolls, uh, you get them from clearing dungeons, or you can trade with players. Also, NPCs around the map who you can accept quests from. Uh, you can accept it. And to see your quest, you press this Q button. Also, for the party, if you want to join a party or accept the party or make a party, go to here. You can create a party by doing that, and then you can press these plus signs to invite them. Uh, you can also accept party requests from here. For this button, it's like the trade button. Uh, you can trade, request trades from other people, or accept trades from other people. For your skills, you see how I have skills here. When you first join the game, you won't have them. So to access them, you want to press K, and then you see you can get different skills at different levels, and then you can combine them to a keybind, and then you want to press save. If you oh for this buffs, uh, this one is your runes. So if you somehow manage to get a rune, you want to right click it, it'll disappear, and then you press K, go to buffs, equip it, and then you can press. It should be this five ability over here another shop that's important is this weapon upgrade shop so you go to this guy and basically you can upgrade your gear with these essence stones or these crystals you can get crystals by obtaining it with by mining it in dungeons um, and basically you can trade it in for essences to become a miner like these guys who have these miner hats uh, you go over here all the way back here by the way this is on the opposite side of the whole entire spawn so it's on the opposite side of the spawn I also have map uh i'll have a map on the screen to display the whole lobby map uh, so basically you talk to this guy you can become a miner except you become a miner don't worry you won't lose anything you'll just become a miner so you can't actually fight in dungeons if you want to be a hunter uh go back to the spawn where i said remember that guy where i said you can become a hunter from him and yada yada yeah, I think that gives you a basic tutorial on things around here. Um, if you want, 
to level up fast, uh, I recommend joining a party. If you're first, if you're a new player, I recommend doing E ranks first until you're at least like level 10, 15 ish, and then you can maybe try taking on a C rank. Anyways, that should be enough for the tutorial. If you need help, ask in comments. Bye.